What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 20MT coins, head on over to NBA MT Zone and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 MyT video and guys today, guys uh, a lot of stuff is going on with the market so pretty much if you listen to my tips and invest you're going to make a ton of MT, if you did it you're going to take an L, as usual drop the 20,000 MT in the comments, like the video if you're new, uh, happy new year to all you guys and also thank you guys for 3k, I didn't get to post a video yesterday, I was so busy, I literally wasn't home all day so... I literally was home for about 20 minutes. Like, I woke up, went somewhere, was out all day, got home for 20 minutes, and then left again. So, sorry for that. 20K in the comments. Uh, but, yeah, we got a lot of tips today. Today is going to be a classic sell day. And let's start it off with uh, some moments, players. So, right off the bat, if you don't know, I did get Kyrie for around 40-ish K. And he's around 64, then 68, then 70, then 90. So, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait a little longer. Hopefully he goes up. I'm going to show you how much I'm going to make in this video. What I picked up over the last week or so. The best of 2K20 cards are also up. Curry's around 80-something K when he was 60-ish K like yesterday or two days ago. <coughs> so, if you did <coughs> pick up those cards, you dubbed out. So, <coughs> I'm going to go over everything. New one just posted. Alright. So, we got that. We got... <coughs> I picked up Carl Anthony Towns. <clears throat> I'm going to show you that right now. <clears throat> I picked up Clint Capello. Carly Towns. He is around 60K right now. Um, I got him for 40K on the dot. That is 50K made. That's dubs. We got Clint Capello in a pack. He was going for around 20. He's probably still around 25-ish, I would say. 24.9. 22. All right. I did sell for 22. Not bad. <clears throat> I got him for free anyway. So we got... Cat and K Clint Capella. We got Cat at 60K, which is crazy. He should keep rising. Uh, we got Pink Diamond Will at 39K. He's around 55, so that's dubs. We're pretty much just going to go everything. Yao is up to like 160, 170. Uh, I have a ton of MJ's Amethyst. So, pretty much every single card you've gotten from this market crash, we're going to go over. We're going to go over the best of 2K20 set, what was in packs. They pretty much all went up. And also, if you do want to pop packs right now, you probably get the most value out. So, Amethyst MJ is cheap. Honestly, if you want, he's kind of rare. I would stack up on him. I'm so broken. All right, listen. I have a lot of players invested in. So, you're going to say, why would I listen to this kid? He's broke. I mean, I invested all my MT and I'm waiting for them to go up. Right now, I would try to snipe some MJs and wait. He could probably go up to like 20K. You have to remember, bro, it's, it's it's not the best MJ, but it is MJ. So he's got to be good. He's got to be worth grabbing, you know? So pick up this MJ for around 13 or less. That's that's my methods. He could go up over 20K. Also, if you do want to do the John Havlicek set, you could get a chance at getting J.R. Smith. I'm going to go over and show you. I think it's the... No, it's not lights out. It is the... Uh, which multi-dimensional so i need john havlicek to do this how much is he he's really expensive so i don't know if it's worth it then but i could do it for the low if i had this john havlicek because i have jordan and this dave the bushers mad cheap but other than that waiting so i'm going to show you what i have stocked up i have a yao Ming. i've been waiting on him for a while i have pedges stacked up i have a curry stacked up a yao stacked up Kyrie stacked up I have a Pascal set up. Will, I have three Wilts. I have a Clint Capella, uh, Donovan Mitchell, which I forgot about. I have a Carl Anthony Town stocked up. Let's check out Donovan Mitchell's price. I got him for around 120, which isn't the biggest profit margin. Let's see what he's going for now. If he's a buy that. Oh, wow. He has went up to 199K. And guess who has... Look at that. So, if you have listened to my methods, you are going to make thousands and thousands of mt now we're probably gonna have a little market crash tomorrow i don't know what's dropping i'm gonna sell most of my stuff either today or i'm gonna sell most of myself sunday now these packs are gone in the day 23 these are gone in the day 23 wait a second today's all right yeah so these are all today's wednesday honestly i would sell most of my cards tomorrow it's only wednesday today the market's gonna continue to rise bro 2k has been dropping some crazy crazy content so 
they're not going to drop it i think they're going to let the market go up a little bit the next two days and also if you don't know we do have a new pink diamond dirk nowinski and if you guys are like 10 and 0 or 11 and 0 uh you can literally just if you are 11 and 0 and you play a game and you win you literally get dirk so like they literally don't update it if you want already so you have a chance of getting dirk you have a what? I can get Baron Davis at 11 wins too. We're going to have to grind this. We're going to have to grind some of this on stream in my budget squad. But uh, yeah, so we're probably going to be grinding soon. Possibly tomorrow stream. I really want this Baron Davis. So you get Baron Davis at 11, 12. You get Dirk Daddy. Kind of crazy. I'm honestly hyped. He's probably stacked as hell. All right, so I'm trying to think. So right now. I'm going to show you Yao Ming's price too because his price is crazy. I literally told you he was about 120k. Now he's at 160. He'll probably end up selling for around 176. This one's at 180 with both diamond contracts. That's kind of a snag. But I've waited for this car to go up and it has. I have him still. Um, what was the other card? So if you guys don't know, Wilt was impacts again. He is around 50-ish k, which is dubs because he was around 30-ish k. Uh, like 35 40k i believe he's around like 52k to 55k so if that's the case if you guys picked up some that's dubs pretty much if you listen to anything any of my mt methods when i told you to pick up you dub down because you're gonna make a ton of mt we got this wilt going for around 49 50 ish all right so he's around 50 45k which is actually a pretty good price to pick him up now that's the thing people could still spam these locker codes People are still like making other accounts, spamming these locker codes, trying to get Will to sell him and transfer it to his other account. So that's the one problem with these locker codes. There's also a couple new locker codes. One's for tokens, some's for MT. So if you guys don't know, I'm going to show you one that I actually did not type in. We have a locker code. This is one locker code. It's codes, packs, MT, token now. So you got a chance at three packs. They're low key terrible because you're not going to get anything. We got a tokens one, 10, 20, or 30 tokens, which I did. It's codes dash 10, 30 dash tokens dash guarantee. But anyways, besides those, we also have triple threat bonus tokens, I think. Let's see what we got. We got an extra ball drive after every triple threat win. So I'm going to have to play some all that triple threat. We might stream for a little bit later, later, later tonight because I'm going to be out all day today. I got another busy day. But uh, yeah, so right now, I'll recap of everything. So right now. Any cards you have. Uh, alrighty, so overall, let's talk about how much we're gonna make. Pretty much every player I do have, and every player I bought. So NBA 2K20 collection. If you guys probably got a ton of amethyst if you did pop packs, Hakeem Olajuwon is probably about 30% more. Let's check his price. So he's around 8k. Honestly, if you want, Hakeem would not be a card, a bad card to stack up. It is Hakeem. A lot of budget ballers are going to want an Akeem on their team, bro. It's Akeem Olajuwon. He's actually an Amethyst. We're going to see like a pink diamond sooner or later, but not a bad Amethyst to stack up on. I would not sell any of the Amethysts. You know why? Because they are spam in the auction. They do, they're going to have some value in about three weeks to a month. So pretty much, I know it's going to be a long time for you to wait, but I would recommend keeping all your Amethysts for now. Do not sell yet. Maybe sell Sunday. But these 2K20 packs are, are gone in about 23 hours. So I would honestly wait. Any cards you have besides the Amethyst you can sell. Let's check Bosch's price as well. So pretty much I would recommend selling. But then again, I kind of want to wait an extra day because they're not going to drop content tomorrow. They're going to drop content Friday. It's possibly going to be a Spotlight series. If it's a Spotlight series, I'll be grinding. And right now, bro, Chris Bosch is probably one of the best center power forwards in the game. And I would... Honestly, I would pick him up if I were you. Right now, 189k is probably the cheapest I saw him since he's dropped. So, 189k Chris Bot. If you get him for 173, that's even better. But yeah, this is probably one of the best power forwards in the game. And also, I forgot I do have Lamar Odom. I got him for around 68k. I believe he's around 80 something. So we're gonna check that out. Uh, Lamar Odom is mad, mad OP. Yeah, he's above 80k. He's one of the most like hyped cards in the game. Everybody loves him. He's at 91k. I got him for 68k. So that's another dub for me. Pretty much every method that I've done worked. Every method that I told you guys has worked. If I told you to stock up, congratulations, you made MT. I stocked up pretty hard. If you stocked up on moments, you could sell now, and make a ton of MT. Pretty much everything I've touched on the auction, I'm gonna make a ton of MT. 
So I told you guys my methods. Now do them. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more content. Peace.